Hello everyone, it's Jessica and welcome to another thrifting in 2022 video. Every week here on my channel, I take you thrifting. I do show you some of the interesting home decor items that catch my eye. And at the end of each of my videos, I do share with you everything that I purchased. And I usually share how I plan on using or styling those items in my home. And if you are new here and enjoy thrifting videos, hit that subscribe button and make sure you turn on the notification bell. That way you will be notified every time I upload a new video. And let me know your favorite item on today's thrifting trip. I really enjoy reading everybody's answers down below. So the first item that caught my attention on today's trip was the glass bottle with the ship inside and it reminded me that me and my family are going on a cruise this summer and I'm so excited to go. So this particular piece was from West Elm and I thought it was a pretty good deal at $2.99 and I would be curious to know if anybody else has any fun summer travel plans. Let me know down in the comments. I would love to hear where you guys are going. So I did almost purchase this tech organization wallet. It's great for all of your earbuds and your cords and chargers and stuff. But then I remembered I just bought a set of packing cubes and it had something similar with it already. So I went ahead and passed on this one, but I thought I would share it with you guys because it was pretty cool. I spotted this beautiful little glass whale statue and I had to check it out. Unfortunately, it was missing an entire fin on the other side. I feel like you could display this with the missing fin towards the back and nobody would ever really know. It was a Murano glass piece and it was a great deal for 99 cents. For all my Patricias out there watching, this one's for you. When 
when I was checking out the lamp section, I noticed this really cool little stoplight lamp and I had to check it out to see if it worked. I plugged it in, but I felt like it was really glitchy and only the yellow light was blinking. So I did leave it behind, but the price on it was $4.99. I didn't see very many interesting furniture pieces on today's trip, but I did spot this wooden rolling desk. It was in great condition and it was a really good price at only $9.99. So before I share with you my thrift haul for today, I thought I would also share with you what I donated. I like to practice the one in one out rule anytime that I purchase something, whether it's thrifted or brand new. And today I donated two pieces of luggage that were still in great condition, but I did recently get new luggage for my daughter Hannah and I. We are going on a cruise this summer, so I definitely wanted some new luggage for us. I thought I would share with you what we got just in case you are also in the market for some new luggage. These are made by Level 8 Cases, and I will have them linked below for you guys. And you can also purchase these on Amazon as well. And here is what the luggage looks like once you unzip them. I really like the color of the mesh lining, and there's plenty of zippered pockets to secure all of your stuff. And I also got a set of their packing cubes to organize all of my makeup, tech items, and shoes. I like to keep all of that stuff separated. So both of these are 20 inches, which is a perfect size for carry-on luggage if you happen to be flying. The outer case is hard, and the 360 wheels are so smooth. And I also love the built-in TSA approved locks. My old luggage didn't have any locks and this is definitely my favorite feature. Like I mentioned earlier, I will have both of these level 8 cases linked in my description box in case you're interested. And now let's get into today's thrift haul. So I purchased three items from today's trip and I spent a total of $10.05 with tax. The first item that I purchased was something that I spotted on one of the dress racks on my way to the home decor section. I saw this beautiful pink robe, so I thought I would check it out because it looked really nice and soft. The price was $4.89. The robe was made by Soma and I have been in a Soma store before and their stuff is pretty pricey so I definitely got a good deal on this robe. So I have already washed and worn it and it's so comfortable and soft. I really love the color and the lining inside. It's not itchy at all and I was really happy to score this. The next item that I purchased from today's trip was this salad spinner right here. It was only $3.49 and when I tested it out in the store, it seemed like it would work really good, so I went ahead and grabbed it. It also happened to be an OXO brand salad spinner and this retails for about $30 and I will link the Amazon link down below in case you're interested because I love how this thing worked. I was really impressed with it and it's so much easier to use than the cheap salad spinner that I was using before. And the last item that I purchased from today's trip was this random toilet paper roll extender for 99 cents. I was really happy to score this and let me show you why. So I recently bought a huge supply of toilet paper from Costco and their rolls of toilet paper are a lot thicker than what I was used to buying. So it made it really hard for me to pull my toilet paper when I had a fresh roll. So here I am putting the extender on and it helps so much. These things retail for $10 on Amazon, and since it worked really well, I will probably order another one for my upstairs bathroom, and I will put the link in my description box in case you want to also check them out. And like I mentioned earlier in the video, I do like to practice the one in one out rule. So I gathered up my old robe and my salad spinner to donate. Since I found better ones today, I no longer need the old ones. So that is everything that I found on today's Goodwill thrifting trip. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it inspires you to go out and go thrifting because you never know what you're going to find out there. Thank you guys so much for watching today and I will see you next week with a new video.